It is an incredible day, and um, I, there were days when I wasn't sure we'd ever get here. So it's Governor Larry Hogan announced the end of Maryland's state of emergency. He's lifting all remaining COVID-19 health restrictions and mandates on July 1st, which means no masks or face coverings will be required in any setting, including schools, camps, and child care facilities, though businesses and local jurisdictions will still be able to set their own policies. But there will not be any legal mandate from the state for wearing masks at any location anywhere in the state. It's a move made possible, he said, as vaccinations increase and infections decline. 72% of adult residents have now had at least one shot. Word of what's to come spread quickly along state circle. I'm just excited um, the, the mask is still an encumbrance, even though you know it's saving your life. So I'm very excited. We're in a much better place. It's definitely not over. I mean, I've had both of my vaccines and I'm doing fine. So just hoping, you know what I mean? And I'm still trying to stay safe, so I keep my mask on. To help folks ease back into normal life, there is a 45-day grace period, the governor said. Starting July 1st through August 15th, the relaxation of certain state regulations continues, including an additional 45 days to renew an expired driver's license and the eviction moratorium extended through August 15th. It's not mission accomplished. The battle's not over. We're transitioning from a state of emergency to an ongoing operation. The governor also stressed several times today that while this is a major step forward in the recovery, the virus and its variants remain a threat and people who are not vaccinated remain at risk. Live at the State House tonight, I'm Kate Amara, WBAL TV 11 News.